Zubera, you're fighting here in Sweden now. How do you feel about fighting in front of the Swedish fans? I думаю, что я смогу показать хороший бой с моей стороны. I uh, I'm very glad I have a chance to come to Sweden. I've been looking forward to this, and uh, I think it will be a good fight, a decent fight, and uh, I think Chavez will do his best, and uh, I'm also looking forward to it and uh, expect to do my best. Now uh, you're coming off a win in your UFC debut, and what lessons have you learned from that fight? Сейчас, я думаю, намного легче будет и без переживаний, без всяких эмоций. I uh, thought a lot about my uh, debut uh, fight and uh, I, I analyzed it. I think I've uh, understood a lot and I made uh, some, some drawn some lessons out of this. Uh, I do, in fact, expect that my second fight uh, will be psychologically will be easier uh, and uh, not. Uh, 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 there, there will be not so much, so, me, so much emotion on my part as it was in the first fight. All right, now you're facing Ernest Chavez, a fighter who has two fights in the UFC. How do you see him as an opponent, and is there any area where you feel you're stronger? Problem. Hot on Petra, four times. Will he put that side? My deal. I don't think about uh, how many times my opponent has fought. Was it two times, three, or five times? It uh, doesn't really matter for me. Uh, it must be a good fight, uh, and uh, I'm uh, fully uh, oriented, geared towards towards this fight and concentrating on it. When we spoke with Ernest Chavez and we asked him a similar question about advantages, he said movement was a big uh, was a big key in this fight. How do you feel about that statement? I think uh, he's probably right, and I think he uh, watched my fights as well and analyzed uh, the, the tactics. Uh, I think it will be a tough fight, uh, both uh, standing and uh, moving, so we'll try to make the best of it. Now, you're born in, well, technically part of Russia, but you uh, spent a lot of time at Tiger Muay Thai in Thailand. What prompted this move and this training over there? Так же, как в Америке, в Таиланде. Это хорошо, там хорошо готовит меня. The, the, the fact is that uh, there are no uh, top-class specialists in Russia. In, uh, in Thailand, in Thailand uh, it's uh, like uh, in the U.S. actually. Uh, you have Americans, uh, Mexicans, uh, the uh, Thai experts working with me, preparing me. So I, I feel I get the chance to be better prepared there. And uh, not, not only myself, of course, there, there were several names of the f other fighters who, who also train in, in Thailand. And how would you consider yourself as a fighter? Would you say you're more of a striker, more of a grappler, all around? Do you even think it's possible to define yourself as a fighter? I like the box. It's really how it looks from the side. I think I'm rather an all-round fighter, and I feel at home in uh, different uh, with different techniques. But I like boxing; uh, it's also more spectacular, and uh, I, I enjoy boxing. So, would you prefer to keep a fight against Ernest Chavez on the feet on Saturday night? Yeah, thank you. On the Yes, that, that's yes. true. On, on feet. So, is it safe to say you're looking for a knockout win? Это только Всевышний знает, как закончится бой. Ну, надеюсь, иншалла, я стараюсь на кого там выиграть бой. Well, uh, I do hope, but only the God Almighty may know uh, what the outcome will be. But uh, I'm training and I'm hoping. All right. Well, I think your heart's in the right place. I think the fans also want to see a striking battle. And what do you think those fans should expect from seeing you? Because I think a lot of Swedish fans maybe haven't seen you fight before. I'll try to impress them, to surprise them, and so that next time uh, they, they will uh, be holding my side. All right, well, I'm sure a good performance will secure that. This is Sebastian Mel Martinez, MMA Nut, here with Zubair Tukogov, who faces Ernest Chavez in UFC Fight Night Stockholm.